thank you for joining me today on um, another video. Uh, yes, I know I haven't really done many videos in quite a while. Um, most of you who watch me on a regular basis will know that um, I have my little girl Sophia and she's obviously in summer holidays at the moment um, which means for me to actually get a chance to come into the studio and do video and without having mummy 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 and the occasional mummy I need a poo um, sorry I know too much information but those of you who watch my videos will know that she does come in and do that so um, I'm actually doing this in the evening she's now in bed hubby's got the dinner on and I thought right I'm gonna do a video because I need to um, I have got one or two bits, new bits and that to show you, but I'm not doing a video about that tonight. Um, what I thought I would do is start, start one of um, one of the series of that quite a lot of people do, like my top fives and whatever. Um, so I'm going to do um, a whole succession of my top five, and I want to do everything. Highlight, eyeshadow, mascara, foundation, skincare products, la di da di da di da di da um, I want to do it all. I want to, you know, I, I want you to know what my favourite favourite products are. Oh, by the way, I don't know if you can see my top I've got on tonight. I've got a gypsy top on tonight, which I got from Sainsbury's too, which was really, really nice. I'm not going to get up and show you the whole thing because I have been out today, been um, at my friend Emily's and her little boys, um, and I am actually covered in um, chocolate and ice cream and uh, since I got home I'm actually covered in pasta sauce as well so I look really attractive not so I'm not going to show you my whole top so no so anyway we'll get on with this okay so we're going to do five through two one um and I'm not going to say that these are in any particular order, although I do have a few that are real favourites. And I mean real favourites. And I obviously the, the real favourite will go at number one. Um, but at number five, um, now this was a really, really difficult one for me to do um, because this, I think, is actually a two-parter I've only brought one part down um, and you'll probably think what on earth is she talking about but it's the golden sugar palette now you've obviously got the golden sugar 2 palette now obviously by the way those of you who've never seen me before this is a makeup revolution product and I'm a massive massive makeup, Re makeup revolution fan I am the very first ever revaholic um, and if you think and why is she the very first ever Revaholic? It was because I came up with the slogan Revaholic. Long story, and I'm just going to drop it there. Anyway, the Golden Sugar Palette. I absolutely love this. Um, it's classed as a blush palette, um, and I don't particularly think it is a blush palette, although you have got a contour um, colour there, which is really good for, obviously, contouring. Um... <laughs> well, it's a contour colour and it's good for contouring. Now, there you go. <laughs> Breaking news. Um, but this has got lots of other, what I would call highlighters in them. Um, you know, I mean, some of these are pretending to be blushes. Um, like this one here is pretending to be a blush and I think that that is a highlight. This one here is pretending to be a blush and it's a highlight and this one here is definitely pretending to be a blusher and it's definitely a highlight um, so as you can see this has got eight pans in um, you have I mean obviously this one is stating the obvious that it is a highlight and this has become almost like Makeup Revolution's um, flagship highlighter if that makes sense because most of the stuff that they do will have a highlight in there that is marbled with a gold vein um, and it, it is absolutely gorgeous and for those of you who don't know but Makeup Obsession is also part of Tam Beauty who owns Makeup Revolution um, and they have one of these in their range and also the Freedom um, Pro Artist 
the um, the new HD range they've just brought out. They have a set of highlighters in that, and there is one of these in there as well. So it's not original item, but it doesn't matter because this is an original item as far as I'm concerned to Makeup Revolution. Um, but yeah, I mean, the, the highlights are just absolutely beautiful in this palette. You've got a gorgeous mix. You've got, you've got your, a pink champagne. I mean, I absolutely love this colour here. This is possibly one of my favourite, favourite colours. I just think it's absolutely beautiful. It's a, how could I describe it? I would say it's probably like a champagne-y, champagne -y sort of, champagne colour really and it really is beautiful it's just gorgeous um you've got this one here as well which is a little bit more subtle this isn't an in your face bling bling this is more of a, an inner glow one but that is just absolutely beautiful and obviously i'm gonna have to give you a swatch of the white one with the gold fleck running through because it would be rude not to and I don't ever like to be rude. If you can see there. So it is really... I mean, they're beautiful. They are really, really beautiful. Um, I mean, what I also like about this is the fact that they don't necessarily jump off the page at you as being the most blinkiest highlighters that there are. But no, that is really good value. Um, and I think this is £6. Um, available at Tan Beauty and Superdrug, which... £6 for eight highlighters. Hey, that's just amazing. Rolling in at number four, we have <laughs> Nip and Fab. And this is the highlight palette in Strobe. Stroboscopic. Stroboscopic. Yeah, Stroboscopic. Um, this is beautiful. Um, I also think that this is a dupe um, for another palette which is in this top five, um, which I won't go into at the moment, but this is um, six, obviously, as you can see, six highlighters, and they're all blatant, they're not, they're not highlighters pretending to be blushes or highlight pretending to be anything else, they are highlighters masquerading as highlighters, um, they're beautiful, there's um, there's nothing pretentious about them. There's nothing in them that says, hey, look at me, I'm fantastic. And they're not. They are just fantastic. Um, they are just absolutely beautiful. And they are varying on a theme. They're, you know, they're, there's nothing dramatically different between them. Um, they are just absolutely beautiful. If you can see, they are just gorgeous. They can build up to give you a bit of bling, um, but if you wore them like lightly, then they would look just subtle and that inner glow. Um, and then we have these ones here. This one is again one of my favourites. Um, this reminds me of a colour called tourmaline actually which I will go on to in a minute. You've probably already guessed which one I'm talking about. Um, so there's there are the other two. I'll just swatch these here, because otherwise I'm going to be all... I'll tell you, I'm going to be so covered in highlight, I'm just going to come out of here looking like... I don't know, looking like I'm... just sparkle. I'm just... I'm going to be twinkle and sparkle. Um, so yeah, so this obviously could pass as a bronzer, which would be really good, but this is definitely, definitely, obviously... A highlight really good for darker skin tones um, so the likes of the beautiful Tammy Clark um, who I adore and she's just fabulous and very good friend um, she would be able to get away with them so I think that in this palette here I think it's a really good shade range um, change range <laughs> shade range um, from being really really pale um, right the way through to being like with this one here to be a nice and dark and deep. So that's number four. So in now at number three. Okay, number three. Now this one is a very, very understated palette. And this isn't bling bling in your face whatsoever. This is subtle. This is healthy glow. Um, 
I will say that there are only two out of this. There's four in this all together, and there's only two out of this that I actually do wear. Um, and this is the high, uh, no, isn't it? It's the HD Pro Stro palette by Makeup Revolution. Also, um, so you've got four highlighters in there. You've got your Stro balm. So you've got um, these two here, which, as you can see, have been fingered quite a lot. Um, now, get your mind out of the gutter. Now, the reason they've been fingered, <laughs> fingered quite a lot is because of Sophia. Oh, look at this, Mummy. Oh, this isn't special, is it, Mummy? Oh, oh. <laughs> right, so these are strobe bums. Now, I don't care for cream highlighters. Um, I really don't because I find no matter how good they're meant to be I mean they look beautiful when you swatch them but when you've got makeup on I tend to find that they move around and move the foundation around and other product underneath the skin and I tend to find that it goes all patchy and then it it it, it goes really really odd so I really do not like balm highlighters although I have loads um, I've got this I've got several um, several of these in pans and I never use them because I just don't reach for them I don't get on with them I just find that they are you know I just don't find that they are a match for me however these two here O M G. These two here are just the mutts nuts. They really are. Um, so you've got this beautiful peachy colour and this beautiful like a dusky rose kind of colour. <sighs> I'm running out of space to put this. So the dusky rose colour. Now you're thinking looking at that thing. The flaming heck is she talking about? There's no highlight on that at all. It's not your in your face, cha chang. It is, it warms your face up or lightens your face. It's, it's not, it's like for that beautiful natural glow when you want to look like a no makeup day. They are just gorgeous, totally and utterly. I am physically running out of space here. I don't know if you can see these two here. Just about. They just give the prettiest glow. Um, and it's just it's just lovely. It really is lovely. Let's see if I can see I'll, I have got bling bling on today. Let me just put some on my forehead. I had to laugh, I was watching a video last night where the young girl was actually teaching you how to do blush, highlight and contouring and she was like, you use your finger for highlight? Hmm, it's a different concept I thought. So, I don't know if you can see, I just look like the light is slightly best. I look like I'm on boomerang, don't I? Um, yeah, you can see the light is gently bouncing away from my skin, given the illusion that my skin is soft and dewy, um, but it's not glittery, it's not in your face, and sometimes you don't want that in a highlight, you don't want to walk down the street and that you're like, you know, you, you've got Tinkerbell flying all around you and you look like you've got fairy dust everywhere and whatever. You don't want that all the time. Sometimes you want to be understated and this is perfect. So I keep looking at my forehead because see now I really love that. I love that a lot. So I think this is either six or eight pounds. This originally come in a set um with brushes and whatever at christmas time but they do sell this on its own now um and i think it's great i really like this a lot um okay so for number two 
This is going to be a shock, and I mean this is going to be a real shock um, to everybody, I think, because I go on about how I don't like high end, and it's not, no, I will reword that, it's not because I don't like high end, it's because high end is obviously very expensive, and I don't have the money to spend on high end, I would much rather spend the money, um, one, on Sophia, two, um, on other things, and three, what's the point most of the time when you can get something from like Makeup Revolution for like a quarter or a fifth or a tenth of the price. Um, but this I did buy um, and I've got no regrets of buying this whatsoever because I just adore this palette. And this is one of the glow kits from Anastasia Barbary. But <laughs> Anastasia Beverly Hills, darling. Anastasia Beverly Hills. <laughs> um, and this is a sun dipped um, glow kit, and I just, I just adore this. This is just so beautiful. Um, it, it's just, it's just mega. I mean, just like look at this. Okay, that is just absolutely beautiful. So, we've got Bronzed, Summer, Moonstone, and Tourmaline. And Tourmaline is my favourite. Don't ask me why, but it is. And it is it is just beautiful. It says on the back here that you're supposed to use within 12 months of opening. Do you know what? The amount of makeup that I've got, I will not have used any of my stuff up completely in 12 years. So, what I also like about this palette is that you can actually take the pans out. Um, and I, I, I think you're able to, to replace each pan individually. Now, that one is clearly a bronzer to me. But again, for beautiful cocoa skin or black skin, this works absolutely beautiful as a highlight. Um... Then you've got Summer, which is your very, very pale colour, which just, I mean, honestly, it's just, it is just beautiful. And no, these are not fake. These are real. I don't know if you can see. Um, they look absolutely gorgeous on the skin. I bought these from Sephora when I was in the States a couple of months ago. Oh, look at me. When I was in the States a couple of months ago, darling, I went to Sephora and I bought something from Anastasia Barley Hills. This one is my favourite. This is Tourmaline. I think that is just... It's just beautiful. It's just... Well, it's my favourite. Um, and you've probably noticed the theme all the way through that my favourite sort of colour is that colour. Oh, just look at that. That is just gorgeous. Obviously, I don't wear it like that on my skin. Um, let's sort of blend it out. But it is really beautiful. And I love it. Who cares? I love it. And then you have Moonstone, um, which is more of a, a pinker base. Um, so, that is really bling, bling. But you see, on the swatches, they are no more pigmented, really, than the Makeup Revolution ones. So, but yeah, this is the one what I was saying earlier on about the dupe. Um, see if I can get this in the right order. No, I can't get this in the right order. But I definitely think that this is a really good dupe for this because you've got your different colours. I mean, like, this one is similar to the tourmaline. This one is similar to the bronzed. Um... This one here is similar to Moonstone, and we've got this one here, which is similar to Summer. So, you know, it is... But they're, they're good, they're good. But this, absolutely amazing. 
I wouldn't normally spend this sort of money on a palette, um, but you got to do once. you got to do it once, haven't you? So that's what comes out on my special occasions when I want the bling. And I want to feel special, not look special, because I don't think it necessarily makes you look any different, but it does make you feel a bit different. So here we are. We are at number one. My number one highlight palette. I do beg your pardon, I can hear my husband telling Sophia off. I do apologise. I do apologise. She's been a little bugger at the minute. My favourite all time palette for highlight is the Ultra Pro Glow by Makeup Revolution. Oh, what a surprise, Makeup Revolution, huh? Um, now you'll probably think, well, why isn't there a sleek palette in there? I do like the sleek palettes, but again, I don't, I find them too in your face sometimes. But these, I really, really like. And now you see, again, mm, again, we have the dupe situation here, where somebody has said that this is a dupe, this, the bottom half, is a dupe for this. Um, yes, there's similar, 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 similarities, similarities there, but I don't think it's necessarily spot on dupe. I love this because this is, um, again, a full range, a full spectrum of normal highlighters. And when I say normal highlighters, I'm not talking about duochromes, I'm not talking about out there colours, I'm not talking about mermaid colours and all this and that that are about at the moment, that are the in thing. This is a full spectrum of ordinary colours that you can wear as highlight. So you have a pink, which, beautiful. You have your golden sort of yellowy colour. Um, you have your tourmaline colour. See, I like my tourmaline. Um, and your champagne. So, you know, you've got lots of different colours there. And there there is a colour to suit every skin tone, I would I would say, definitely. Definitely. But yeah, I mean they are very bling. I, I, I'm running out of space here to show you now because I am so full of highlight. I am literally glistening. <laughs> right, okay, let's see what I can do here. Let's see if I can swatch some of these on. Have you ever seen anybody swatch their neck before? Oh, look at that. See what I mean? Right, I'll move over on the other hand because this is impractical to use this. So, yeah, so it's a beautiful bronzy colour, which isn't too bronze. It's not, like, really brown. It's just a, a beautiful, like, coppery bronze, which I really like. Um, this colour here which is just a, more of a muted bronze. We've got two different champagne colours which are just lovely. I'll just put these on my hand. Now you'll have to excuse my hands because my hands are really rough. So beautiful aren't they? And then over on this side we have like a champagne -y pink, champagne -y pink, pink, and then like a yellowy colour, which, you know, again, I like all of these. And again, they're not, they're bling, but they're not too bling. So, yeah. So there you go. That is my all-time top favourite highlighter palettes. Um, I am going to be doing my all-time favourite highlight individuals. I'm talking about highlight. Can you pop it? Come on. We have a little guest down with us at the moment. And she is the highlight of, of our day. She really is. She's obviously playing very hard to get. Um, yeah, so that 
brings me to saying that you know I'm going to be doing my um, individual highlights so my individual pans I want to do my top five eyeshadow colors I want to do my top five foundations etc etc if you do like the idea of this then please comment down below if you've got an eyeshadow no if you have a highlight palette that you really really love and would like to recommend just pop it down in the comments down below um, you know it's it's a great opportunity to share with everybody else your experiences and what you think so if you're not already please subscribe and we'll see you in the next video and give us a thumbs up see you later and take care bye she's come and say hello say hello hello say hello we're looking after at the moment for a friend aren't we yeah, and she's absolutely gorgeous. She's about 14 weeks old. She really is just beautiful. Hi, Papa. Hi. Hi. Yeah, gorgeous girl, aren't you? And we play a game. She goes missing, and we play a game called Where's Willy? Yeah. Rather than Where's Wally? So, yeah, at least she did pop in and say hello at the end. Ta-ta for now.